Welcome back to my YouTube channel MA Automatic Machine The 2026 Tupolev Pak DA is Russia's most ambitious strategic bomber project in decades, representing a dramatic evolution in the nation's long-range aerial strike capabilities. Designed to eventually replace the aging Tu-95 and Tu-160 bombers, the Pak DA is being developed by Tupolev under the strategic direction of the Russian Ministry of Defense. This next-generation aircraft is envisioned not merely as a replacement but as a transformative leap into stealth, hypersonic weapon delivery, and 21st-century warfare. At its core, the Pak DA project is a testament to Russia's intent to maintain parity with the United States and NATO in strategic deterrence. Modeled as a flying wing, the aircraft's shape is optimized for low radar visibility, echoing the philosophy behind the U.S. B-2 Spirit the flying wing configuration offers advantages in radar cross-section reduction and aerodynamic efficiency, both crucial for penetrating advanced air defense systems deployed by potential adversaries. While most of the program's technical details remain classified, leaked specifications and defense analysis indicate that the Pak DA will be capable of carrying a diverse arsenal of weapons. These include conventional cruise missiles, precision-guided bombs, and most significantly, nuclear payloads. The aircraft is expected to integrate Russia's most modern standoff weapons, such as the KH-101 and KH-102, which can hit targets over 5,000 kilometers away without entering hostile airspace. Unlike its predecessors, the Pak DA is designed with stealth in mind from the ground up. Special radar-absorbing materials, internal weapon bays, and smooth contouring all contribute to reducing its radar signature. Its engines are also expected to be fitted with special shielding and exhaust management systems to reduce infrared detection, a critical feature in modern aerial combat environments. The aircraft is reportedly subsonic, a choice that may seem counterintuitive but aligns with its stealth-first doctrine. High-speed bombers like the Tu-160 sacrifice stealth for speed, while the Pak DA takes the opposite route, trusting in visibility and surprise to ensure mission success. This design philosophy is consistent with current global trends in strategic aviation, where survivability in dense, defended airspace is more valuable than outright speed. Pak DA is also expected to boast impressive endurance and range, thanks to modern fuel-efficient engines and aerodynamic efficiency. This long range ensures it can cover strategic targets across continents without relying heavily on mid-air refueling. Such endurance will be crucial for deterrence patrols, long-distance precision strikes, and unpredictable threat projection far from Russian territory. A significant focus of the Pak DA project is its digital brain, a highly integrated avionics suite that offers automated threat analysis, navigation, and weapon deployment. Artificial intelligence elements are likely to play a role in pilot decision-making, helping manage the vast data streams involved in modern warfare. The cockpit is expected to be heavily digitized, reducing pilot workload and enhancing mission efficiency. Moreover, the bomber is likely to be accompanied by swarms of unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, in the future. These drones can conduct reconnaissance, jamming, or even decoy operations to protect the mothership bomber. The integration of manned-unmanned teaming MUM-T, concepts is becoming increasingly essential in the next generation of warfare, and Pak DA seems to be built with that synergy in mind. One of the revolutionary aspects of the Pak DA could be its compatibility with hypersonic weapons. Although not yet confirmed officially, Russian sources suggest that future variants may carry smaller hypersonic missiles